Hello everybody, welcome back to another MATLAB tutorial and today I'm going to talk about a file that I found on the internet, very very cool file that I'm going to be using later on projects with the Arduino chip and you'll see what, I'm going to, what applications you can use it on. The file that I found was the tracking red color object using MATLAB. Oh, that's powerful stuff. And it's made by Mr. A. Baha Anab. I'm sorry I mispronounced your name, Mr. Baha, but I thank you very much for uploading this file for everybody to see and to share with us. Thank you very much. Before you uh, download this uh, submission, please read the license. Click on that, read, and make sure you understand what you're doing. Go ahead and download and thank you again. You are a genius. Thank you for, for uh, uploading this beautiful, beautiful code. I'm going to go ahead and save the file, I'll minimize this, I'm going to open my zip file, and the zip file comes with three files, I'm just going to put them in the desktop for now, just to um, make it easier, make it fast, I'm going to make this video real quick. So I have my three files here, license, get camera info, red object tracking, beautiful. Go ahead, uh, let me close this, so I can restart it from the beginning, go ahead, open your MATLAB program. And uh, there's several ways you could do this. Uh, I did a couple of ways; they didn't work for me. This is the quickest way that it, it worked. It worked. It worked for me. So first of all, I'm going to have I have three, two cameras in my computer right now. I have the one that was built in in the computer, and then I have a USB webcam. So what I'm going to do is just first on right here type. We're just going to grab some information, find out which camera you're going to use. So I'm going to just go ahead and type. Info. I'm. I'm. H when. Win video. And I'm gonna go ahead and press that. Enter. And here is uh, some of the information, the win video, and uh, see how it's showing three devices. I mostly, I, I usually just have two. The number two, it's my built-in webcam, and number three is my USB webcam. So what I'm going to do is just get some uh, information about my USB webcam. That's the one I'm going to be using for today's program. And I'm going to go ahead and click Win Info, press the Tab button, and you're going to see these options come out. So I'm gonna just want, I need some information. I'm going to go ahead and click that. And we're going to go ahead, and I know this is my uh, webcam through the USB, so I'm going to just go ahead and do in parentheses 3 and press Enter. And there we go. We got the USB 2 camera, device number 3. And this is what we're going to, this is the command that we're going to be using later on to distinct if we want to use that camera and here the formats supported uh, if you want more information you just go ahead and uh, info I'm gonna put dot and go ahead and press tap again and click the by supporting no no I don't want that tap uh, formats and go ahead and click enter and those are the formats. And if you want to check it, uh, test it out, just go ahead and type it. Then video. And I'm gonna go ahead and copy this. Paste here. Press enter. Oh. There you go, and then I'm uh, just going to do a quick preview. Press on it, and then there we go. You can see, and this is my table right there. And you can make this bigger if you like. Let's just leave it there for now. So, you got that. Let's go ahead and close that out. And it, uh, if you decide to, uh, if you want to get a snapshot, yes, uh, we can name it as for snapshot. You can always do this um, command get snap shot with then type image 
that's for snapshot and that's the snapshot okay now that we got a camera set up go ahead and uh open the file and uh open the brilliant brilliant code that was uh given to us and uh, i'm gonna open the red archer track i'm gonna go ahead and open that and then here we got the code that it was given to us it was uploaded by mr I'm sorry, I cannot pronounce your name right, but thank you very much. And please make a video if you're watching and go ahead and go over some of the details of your code. So there we go. Uh, since we already have the info, we I hate to do this. But I'm going to just change some things around. I know, I know. I'm just going to go ahead and do this here. Since I don't need that because I already know my video info. And once again... I'm going to go ahead and I know my video info so I could type in it manually and uh, media info is going to be when video and number three that's the one I'm using and that's all I did I keep everything so you don't want to mess with his code and then go ahead and click save and run change the folder and here we go it's running oh you can see that oh look at that look at that it's tracking the red eye I'm gonna go ahead and lift this up and I'm gonna move this back and forth and see that wow this is some powerful stuff this is some powerful stuff and the applications could be endless you could use like I'm going to be using in the future I'm going to use this code and track an object using the robot the robot's going to move depending on the position of the red object and you can modify this uh, code and it doesn't have to be red it could be yellow whatever colors you just gotta read through it understand it and use it thank you very much guys